सो वेलकम गाइस इन द सेकंड पार्ट ऑफ द मैथमेटिक्स वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द कोऑर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री एंड इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन द टॉपिक्स ऑफ स्ट्रेट लाइन दैट इज रिकॉल ऑफ टू डी ज्योमेट्री फर्स्ट वी हैव सीन द कार्टेशियन कोऑर्डिनेट सिस्टम्स एंड सेकंड वी हैव सीन द डिस्टेंस फॉर्मूला नाउ टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द सेक्शन फॉर्मूला so before going to section formula one most important topic was left the topic is uh, area of a triangle okay area of a triangle which is in coordinate system because everyone know that uh, the area of triangle is half into base into height but in coordinate system it is not like that uh, if we are given the three coordinates of a triangle uh, suppose the three points of a triangle abc like a b and c are given such that x1 y1 b x2 y2 and c x3 y3 okay then the area of the triangle the area of triangle a b c will be what will be half there is a formula uh, to remember this formula we have a trick like first you write the coordinate y then give a bracket plus y then again give a bracket and plus y then again give a bracket okay then number this y 1 2 and 3 and in bracket write x minus x in this bracket also write x minus x and this also x minus x then according to the cyclic order first one then two and then three then again back to one this is one then it will be two this will be three this is two then comes three then comes one okay this is three then after three it is one and then again two so for remember this formula i have this is uh, this trick i have used just remember there is a modular sign uh this is one format of uh, the area of a triangle the next format is the answer will be same but the next format is half it is in the form of a determinant okay this is x1 y1 1 x2 y2 1 x3 y3 1 see we have not covered the topic of matrix and determinant so we will not going to this formula right now we will use this formula or you can use another form of this area um, which is very much pretty easy just write down three co uh, three coordinates x1 y1 x2 y2 x3 y3 and again write the first coordinates of the point that is x1 and y1 then for writing the formula give this half then give the modular sign and give a big bracket here then minus next bracket here okay so what will be in the first bracket first bracket will be the summation of these terms x1 y2 x2 y3 x3 y1 that is x1 y2 plus x2 y3 plus x3 y1 okay and in the second bracket we will write this summation of these three terms okay that is x2 y1 plus x3 y2 plus x1 y3 in many books you will find this 
two formats of formula but if we break down this you will find the exactly same formula but uh, for the simplicity of remembering we, we will use this formula or you can use this formula but this formula is same okay now take an example now before going to the example uh, if we we are given a question that uh, find uh, that three points are collinear then what we have to do suppose three points are given a b and c we have to prove that these three points are collinear suppose um, let take that these three points are not collinear and these three points make a triangle always three points make a triangle then um, assume that three points make a triangle then the area the area of triangle you will write the same formula half mod of this term but as they have said that we have to prove these three points are collinear then we have to show that the area of the triangle is becomes zero exactly this format we will use in the in this example they have given that proof a comma b b comma a and a square comma minus of b square these three points are collinear it is proof that okay so uh, as we have seen that the area of the triangle will be zero for uh, the three points are collinear as the three points are collinear therefore we will use the formula half so if we use our easiest formula a comma b b comma a then a square then again minus of b square then again we will write the first coordinate that is a comma b then giving a big bracket here minus big bracket here modulus in the rough part it will be in equal equals to zero okay then we will use our technique a this term and this term so what will be the in the in first bracket it will be a, a into a that is a square plus b into minus b square that is minus of b cube minus of b cube plus a square into b okay then coming second bracket it will it is b into b that is b square plus a into a s a, sorry a into x a square that is a cube and the last one is a into minus of b square that is minus a b square okay sorry i have a mistake that in the question they have um, said that what is the condition for these three points are linear so find it will be find the condition so that these three points are collinear so after solving this equation we have to find the condition of collinearity okay so the half will be cancelled with the zero portion so in the modulus part we are a square minus b cube plus a square b minus b square minus a cube plus of a b square as here it is in it is equals to zero so we can withdraw the modulus part and in from the this expression if we see that here is a square minus b square okay if we take a um, sorry minus a cube then minus b cube then if we take 
a b is common from these two terms it will be a plus b equals to 0 now uh, if we write a square minus b square it will be a plus b into a minus b okay then taking this minus sign common it will be a cube plus b cube plus a b into a plus b equals to 0 what is the formula of a cube plus b cube it is a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square okay and then if we take a plus b common what will be in this third bracket it will be a minus b okay then minus of we have taken this a plus b as common so what will be left in this bracket it is a square minus a b plus b square plus a b equals to zero okay then in in the next step a plus b into a, a minus b minus a square plus a b minus b square plus a b equals to zero in the next step a plus b it is a minus b bracket if you take the minus in common it will be a square a plus b into a plus b sorry a b plus a b it will be 2 a b minus 2 a b plus b square okay it will be 0 so a plus b into a minus b minus of a minus b whole square equals to 0 a plus b and if we take a minus b as common it will be 1 minus a plus b equals to 0 so either a plus b equals to 0 or a minus b equals to 0 or 1 minus a plus b equals to 0 so what are the conditions these are the conditions for this the um, three points a comma b b comma a and a square and minus b square these three points will be collinear if these three condition satisfied so the condition for collinearity conditions for collinearity are a plus b equals to 0 or a minus b equals to 0 or 1 minus a plus b equals to 0 one last application of this formula suppose you are um, given that you have given that um, find the area of a b c d where a minus 2 comma minus 3 b is 6 comma minus 5 c is 18 comma 9 and d is 0 comma 12 so you are given that to find the area of a quadrilateral a b c d so what we will do you will just simple write area of a b c d is half mod give this big bracket minus a big bracket and end it with modulus sign okay now um, use we will use our technique minus 2 comma minus 3 6 comma minus 5 18 comma 9 and 0 comma 12 again we will write the first pair of numbers that is first coordinate in the last one so what will be the result 2 comma min, 2 uh, sorry mm. minus 2 into minus 5 6 into 9 18 into 12 0 into minus 3 this all will add up so the number will be 10 plus 54 plus 216 plus 0 then give this minus and in this in the next bracket it will be 
minus 3 comma mm, minus 3 into 6 minus 5 into 18 9 into 0 minus 2 into 12 all will add up so in this bracket it will be minus 18 minus 90 plus 0 minus 24 okay the result will be half 280 mm, yes, plus 132 answer is half into 412 206 square unit now you have mm, so you guys have question that what is the role of this modular sign if suppose in modulus we have mm, we get minus 32 so it will be 32 automatically that is whenever mm, we so we are solving the modulus problems the answer of any modulus will be a positive number okay so the problems on area of a triangle is end up here in the next class uh, i will discuss about the section formula or the video will be too longer so i will end up here thank you